remember all that? Every power must be accounted for when you do long division? Yes. And on the outside, oh gosh. divided by 2x cubed plus 10x minus 6. Is that Mr. Fitz's class? Because I hope that will by again. <laughs> Smack up. Okay. So, what do I do to two x cubed to get two x to the fourth? Multiply it by x. I need an x. So remember, you multiply each one by that. So I have two x to the fourth, ten x squared. So make sure you line it up under the ten x squared minus six x. Right. Now remember you're subtracting all that. So here you're going to get zero. Here you're still going to get zero, right? Zero minus zero is still zero. Negative five minus ten x squared gives me negative fifteen x squared. Negative fifteen x squared. Then here I'm going to get six x squared. Positive six x. Right? Because zero minus negative. Okay. Now what do I do to two x cubed? Oh, actually I'm done. Look at that. So it's plus my remainder all over my divisor. So that's the first thing. Okay, here we go. When I did long division, all I did was rewrite this to here. Does everyone agree that when I divide, I get this? So instead of taking the limit of that junk, I can take the limit of my answer. This limit as it goes to infinity. Take the limit, which means I can break that up, correct? Take the limit of x, take the limit of that second part. Questions? 